What does the enemy look like? For her latest exhibition, Herlinda Kerbel photographs shooting targets around the world from mass terrorists in Albania to hostage takers in Norway. She set out to capture the many faces of the enemy. Some targets look more abstract than others, but the German photographer shows us they all have one thing in common. They were made to turn people into killers. During the Cold War, the U.S. Army had Ivan the Russian as their target. Today, the enemy looks different. He wears Arab dress. We see that both in the videos I've done as well as the other targets. We also see it in the training facilities for urban combat that are being built to practice asymmetrical warfare. The Arab as the new bogeyman, an obscure enemy combatant without uniform. The U.S. Army has recreated entire cities filled with hundreds of actors to practice urban warfare. Preparations for the worst case scenario in the Arab world. How the targets look depends on whether or not a country actually sends its troops into combat. The U.S. has soldiers fighting wars all over the world. And so their enemy targets look realistic. Not the case in Germany. Its soldiers mostly do peacekeeping missions. Kobel shows us the many faces of warfare, but above all, she focuses on the brutal reality, because when the bullets fly, every soldier is a target.